This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. Okay, so we've linked our architecture model so we can make a start on our Revit MEP building services model. The first thing we did when linking this model was to copy monitor the levels and grids. The next thing we need to do is to create some plan views. From the View tab, select Plan Views and Floor Plan. At this point, I want to create floor plans for the entry level and floors 2 and 3. Select them from the New Plan dialog box and click on OK. This creates the new floor plans, but in doing so has created them as mechanical HVAC floor plans. What I want to do with this model is have some initial plans that I can set to display in the same way as the architect has set his views. If I right click on the view, I can apply a view template. In this case, I'm going to use architectural base plans and click apply. So let's open up that base plan. So what we have here is a view that's looking at the architect's model. And if we go to visibility graphics, we can have a look at how that view is displayed. If we look at the Revit Links tab, we can see that the linked model display settings are by a linked view. If we click on this button, we can see here that the linked view is the floor plan 01 entry level. And this is showing the architect's dimensions, his room names, and various tags associated with his level 1 floor plan. I can repeat this for levels 2 and 3 by selecting them both in the project browser and applying a view template for architectural base plans. Click on Apply and OK. So, you may think you're finished here, but not quite. If I go to level 2, you can see that this actually has some services already in the model. This is not how I want the view to appear. Let's go back to visibility graphics. In here you can see that all the building services categories are visible. So what we can do at this point is go to the view templates and look at the view template settings. Here's my architectural base plans view template and I can change the settings here. So let's turn off all the categories in what is my model. But the Revit link is showed by the linked view. Click on OK and apply that view template again. But we still don't have things quite right. If I go back to visibility graphics and look at the linked view, you'll see in here that the linked view is in fact still level one entry level, where it really wants to be level two. So let's apply that and click on OK. And that's now our architectural base plan for level two. Let's try that with level three. Apply the view template, base plans, apply, OK. Go to Visibility Graphics and just change that to Level 3. Now we have a set of plans that engineers can use for markup because they're identical to the documentation that the architect has sent us. We also have a record of the copy monitored grids. So, should the architect change his grids, we will be able to see a difference 